Hi, this is Sherry Veronica. Every now and again, someone would mention the ancestors and respect and a salute to the ancestors. But um, what do you think is going to happen to Barbados if they, if you, if you do not pull out of your mental enslavement? What do you think is going to happen to you? because you can tell, people can get in the paper and talk about salute ancestors who paved the way. And you know, a lot of you, a lot of you live in your parents' homes, okay? Your parents died and you have moved into their respective homes. So, you know, the old timers did do something. And if you're living in their home, it means that you didn't do much. You actually relied on your mom or your dad or your grandmother to do what you should have done quadruple. You should have done, you should have outdone your ancestors and the people who came before you. You're supposed to get better. That hasn't happened. And what would you do if, if, if you're, since you're talking about respecting the ancestors and saluting the ancestors? what are you going to do? What are you going to do if you're going to respect the ancestors, not put on that additional appendage on your derriere? Are you going to stop teaching classes, teaching people how to um, like uh, walk up? I mean, if a crop over, they actually have classes. Are you going to stop? Are you going to do that? What are you going to do if you actually cash a clue and start to respect your ancestors and maybe have dances with your clothes on you know fully clothed you know you don't see any you know no gyrating just just a dance what are you going to do if you don't come to your senses if you do not come to your senses really and truly what's what's going to happen to 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 you what's what's going to happen to you what will happen to you if you do not if you do not outdo your ancestors. Sherry Veronica.